liftoff at 2.13. The Saturn V building up to 7.6 million pounds of thrust, and it is clear 1970 was also a year of achievements. In April, Americans Frank Lovell, Fred Hayes, and John Swigert set off for the moon in Apollo 13, attempting to emulate the two successful landings of last year. At first, all went well, and the crew were soon sending back from the capsule the routine television pictures to which the world has so quickly become accustomed. It was when they'd nearly reached their destination that the accident happened. Fred Lovell reported laconically to Houston Control. An oxygen tank had exploded, draining the command module of its power and life-giving air. The astronauts had to steer their crippled ship home using only the resources of the tiny lunar module. When they landed back on the deck of the recovery ship Iwo Jima, the whole world joined the cheering. 